and here is the lovely Miss Jojo that I caught completely off guard. I just picked up my camera, hit the film button, and started recording her. Yes, you did. And here she is down here at her sewing center down George's Kentucky Workshop. Miss Jo! Yes? What are you doing? I am cutting out a shirt for myself. A shirt? Mm-hmm. Well, what are those funny square things you've got there? Wait a minute. What, what exactly is that, Miss Jo? I can't remember what my husband called them. Cable tray nuts or something like that. <laughs> but they're perfect pattern weights. They're just the right size and weight. And because they're square-sided, unlike the round ones, it's a lot easier to pick back up. They're uni-strut washers. Yay! Uni-strut washers. Also known as fabric weights. <laughs> and that's what... I love them for welding. You know, it, it's a wonderful little thing for welding and all that. And not to mention, I used to use an awful lot of them in my former trade. But who knew that I'd be buying them in bags of five for my wonderful wife to be using as a weight? They're perfect. Oh, yeah. Did I got I said they're perfect. All you sewers out there need to get some. You can buy them at Lowe's. You can go into Lowe's. And that's all it is. You can go into the electrical department and you can ask anybody for a uni strut nut. Uh, not nut, washer rather. And that's all it is. And I think it's about, I think I paid around $4 for, they're under $5 for a bag of five. And, and a dozen, no, 10 pattern weights on Amazon is about 20 bucks and they're little glass and they will break and they're clear and they're not getting flat so these are less than a dollar a piece buying them retail at Lowe's and you're not gonna hurt these by throwing them on the floor and they're smooth. There's no sharp edges on them or anything. They're not going to rust on you. They got that zinc cadmium plating on them. And we saw a sewing video. Yeah, we, George, was sitting there watching a sewing video with my wonderful wife one day. And there was a gal in there. She had these great big washers. They were like, they're made for like a one-inch bolt. So they were probably about two inches in diameter. And I showed Miss Jo them, and she didn't like it. Plus, they're thinner than these. They're very thin. You need to stack about three of them. So There's Jerry McNeil. Jerry McNeil about the sewing machine that Joe bor borrowed. I'll have one June 16th. <laughs> See that? She's buying another machine. So, another brother. I have no idea. Matter of fact, I'm going to take a quick little walk around Miss Jo there and give you a little view of her next machine. Okay. It's a brother it works on cover too. stitch. <laughs> so. Well, that's it, everybody. I just saw an opportunity to make a video, so there we go. Say goodbye. Wave. Bye.